It's getting late. Where to now? I'd like my friends to try something fun, if you know what I mean. I'll be my guest. Dr. Edward welcomes anyone who's ready for some excitement. How about we use your dreamscape, sir? A superb idea, sir. Let's do it. The one from last night would be perfect. Um, what's going on? Well, this is a service we offer to our long-time customers. You can submit dreams you've recently had to me. With relevant emotion prototypes, I'll be able to turn them into customized dream moments that can be experienced repeatedly. Exactly! Looks like you've got the picture. You probably woken up from a dream one time. <gasps> and wished you could just go back to dreaming it, right? A dream I wished I could have continued after waking up. Miss Firefly, I admire your eagerness, but please be patient. Allow me to use my dream as a demonstration. I trust you have prepared all the necessary materials. Please, hand them over. is appreciated. The retrieval is complete. Calibrate the memoria and generate the dream bubble. It's ready. Please close your eyes and rest your forehead against the dream. Jump on in, friend. I wish you a pleasant time. Is this the clinic in the Bellabog underworld? Why is it empty? This is the surprise that will be revealed later. You have to remember, in a dream, anything is possible, possible, possible. Oh, no need to be hasty now. You should take a moment to get used to the feeling of being in a dream within it. Is this another note? Oh, that's the thing about dreams. Anything can feel familiar. Stop nitpicking the details. If you ask me, I'd say you should take a look outside, but don't get frightened by what you see. Oh, 
I think that's what she means. Ha! Super Abada! Kusa Bata! Habada da da da! Hana Badu! Habada! Essay Badu! Hala Bada! Habada Dura Bata Sarata! Habadu Sabata! Kusa Bada da 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 da! I'm confused. It's getting late. Where to now? Are you ready? Ugh, where's that? Is this the Is this I'm confused. Oga, maka hata na, aga ma de hata hodo jiko, hona ha. Ma, ma, de tata. Tada hidata.
Fuck up, Mama! Can I have fun this time? Time for a bug. <laughs> I see through you. Perfect. I'll free you from your chains. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Bad luck. Yin and Yang. So you are afraid of me. That needs optimizing. Hm. This is double speed. Converge and awake. Human creations. Bad hm. news. Yin and Yang. I finally collected three proofs of trust. Let's go back and deliver them. Is this where the final battle will take place? Not sure how I feel about this. Such a tragic scene. Didn't they say the Garbage King would wait for me here? Have I been set up? I was really looking forward to seeing how our friend was going to overthrow the Garbage King. What a huge pity. Such a meaningful... I was looking forward to seeing your face when the truth dawned on you. Hint at? 
No, more like reveal. Don't you want to find out the truth behind the dream? Don't let all that pretty scenery in the dream world distract you from your goal. As soon as you get complacent, you'll lose sight of the truth. Don't you think this dream bubble looks really similar to modern day Penacone? A small stage is crowded with a bunch of scheming people. None of them want to be exposed under the spotlight, so they all push you to the front. You're not at home anymore, kid. You've wandered into the depths of the unknown. Let me put it to you straight. Don't let yourself get enticed by that glowing light. I'm gonna be very disappointed if you get bamboozled by the likes of them. Same as always, pal. If you still don't get it. Just turn around and take a look. Is that girl still here? She claims to be a local, but doesn't know how this world works. All she's got is street smarts. Who exactly is she? You don't find her the least bit suspicious? You better hurry up and confront her if you have any questions. Don't let her off scot-free. <laughs> See you around, pal. Don't let me down. What did Sampo mean? Is Firefly hiding something? I must find her and demand an explanation from her. She shouldn't be too far off. I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you. There are things... I'm hiding from you. I'm not a local. And there's a reason why the Bloodhound family is after me. I also have my own purpose for joining you on your journey. <laughs> but still, I appreciate your help. I mean it from the bottom of my heart. And, and my admiration for the Nameless is also genuine. You guys have been to a lot of worlds, met people from all walks of life, and experienced all sorts of things. Every day is a new beginning for you guys. bring you one more place it isn't another tourist attraction it, it's my very own secret base and i'll do my best to tell you everything i know when we get there thanks Is something... Hey, Tom! Help! Help me! Someone's dying! Please, come here! I'm not some random thing! I'm a clock! Wait! Can you see me? Mm. Is there a problem? Can you really see me? Tick-tock! Wonderful! This is awesome! There's still hope for Misha. Oops, uh, I haven't introduced myself. My name is Clocky. I'm a famous celebrity in Penacone. My friends and I keep the peace in this small town. They are Hanu, Mr. Soda, Origami Bird, Hamster Ball Knight, and Misha. Misha's in trouble! Tick tock! Help! Help! Clocky? 
T do you mean you saw a cartoon character that doesn't exist in real life? TikTok, I'm really here! As the humble face of Penacomi, I never, ever brag! Um, where is he? I, I can't see him. TikTok, I guess I'm only visible to those with the innocence, kindness, and honesty of a child. Like this kid here clad in gray! Um... <laughs> but I think you look older than me in terms of appearance. Tick-tock! Tick-tock! My great friend, since you can see me, then you must be able to help me! My friend Misha is in trouble! I'm begging you to help him before it's too late! Uh, is it really that bad? Well, are you gonna help this, um, clocky that only you can see? I don't think you're lying, as anything can happen in a dream. We can just head to the place I mentioned later. Tick-tock! Tick-tock! Hurry up and follow me, great friend! Misha's in trouble! He's over there! Let me bring you to him! The name of Misha rings a bell to me. Anyway, better check out what's going on. Come on! Chop, chop! Move as fast as the hamster all night! in the dreamscape back into people's hearts. That way, everyone can patch up their differences and get along again! My gray friend, I require your assistance. I have a feeling you'll be able to master the power of clockwork. After all, you're the special one who can see me. Also, you're a new visitor to this world, which means we have the element of surprise. If you take action now, we can catch him off guard. Here, I'll show you. First, close your eyes. Tick tock. Now, our minds have merged into one. Can you feel an energy? Sir, 
reaching through your body. All we have to do is use clockwork on that cranky gangster boss and inject good emotions into him. Then we'll have won! Please bear in mind that you should never use clockwork with malicious intent. We're the guardians of Dreamville, after all. Tick tock! Mind your own business, lad. We get to see each other again so soon. About all the commotion just now, I heard a bunch of masked fools were causing a ruckus on the streets. I happened to be passing through, got stopped for questioning, and there were some misunderstandings along the way. Anyway, I owe you another one. Is this lady your friend too? <laughs> well, we've only met each other once before, but he is a kind soul for helping me at the hotel. It's my pleasure to meet you, beautiful lady. The beautiful lady? By the way, what did you do to that man earlier? It was like someone took him on an emotional roller coaster. I was wondering about that too. What happened back there exactly? talking about it wasn't talk therapy it was clockwork i don't think it's that simple could it have something to do with that uh clocky that only you can see clocky yes that cartoon character i think he's shown up in reality i mean in the dreamscape i don't really know how a cartoon character could show up around here but according to our friend here only honest people with childlike innocence can see him it seems like I'm too old to qualify for that. If Clucky really exists, that can explain a lot of things. Huh. Can you see me too? I can feel the presence of something inexplicable next to you. But it's a shame that I can't communicate with him like you can. We can both perceive these extraordinary things in the dream, probably due to our ability to react to memoria. But you're more attuned to it than I am. I thought your heightened perception was caused by something the elegant memo keeper might have left in your mind. 
Now it seems to me there are many more special beings like her in this dream. Shortly after we parted ways, I felt someone's spying eyes on me. I looked in the mirror and spotted a lady wearing a black veil. We had a deep conversation, but I won't bore you with the details. It's a shame that I forgot to ask her for her name. I only know that she's from the Garden of Recollection. Garden of Recollection? <gasps> Is that the group that serves the Eon of Remembrance? Exactly. They traverse freely between different worlds as mimetic entities and are only visible to certain people. Doesn't she sound very much like that clocky you saw? After all, it is a grand event held by the family. The guest list could be a lot longer than we imagine. Once again, thank you for being kind to me. I wish you a great time in the dream, and I shall not interrupt your... date? No! We're not on a date! <laughs> <laughs> She's gone. Well, shall we? I'll let you get back to your beeswax. Thanks, my great friend. I really appreciate your help. The Nameless are indeed a bunch of talented people. May our paths cross again. May our paths cross again. Tick tock. Please come with me. I hope that you won't be distracted by some invisible friend again. I'm afraid we need to take the pinball machine to reach this place. Uh, you go first, and I'll be right behind you. Secret stronghold is a a cafe. Here.
Here we are. This is the place. This is... Yes, it's right inside. It doesn't matter. Anything can happen in a dream. And there are lots of people falling from the sky every day. The pedestrians aren't going to be faced by anything. Let me show you how to do it. It's going to be very dark at first, so you'll have to stay close to me. <sighs> hey, let me ask you something. Is following girls around like a lost puppy your way of getting their attention? You've been doing this for nearly half a system hour. To be more precise, it's been 45 minutes. Time sure flies when you're having fun, doesn't it? Ugh, spare me. Beautiful eyes, though. Are you from Sigonia? Need another hint? I'm an Avgen. My eyes might not be as pretty as yours, but there's no problem with my vision. You Sigonians are notorious throughout the entire universe. Liars, thieves, social manipulators, wolves in sheep's clothing. You're really living up to the reputation. I say you belong to the space under the manhole cover, not in a dream. There's one right over there. Off you go. I'll pass. The gloomy shade of a place like that just wouldn't go with my vibe. Dreamville is frivolous, vain, and flashy, and that suits me just fine. Also, it never rains here. My outfit is too expensive to be exposed to the elements. Cut it out and go home, you slick talker. We are fools, but we aren't stupid. We aren't interested in playing the friend game with the lapdogs of the IPC. Really? You've never been friends with anyone from the IPC? Do you think I know nothing about the history of Penacony? Don't drag me into your banal office politics! Fool, you've been left with no choice since the moment you accepted the invitation to be here. You better pick a side while you have the chance. Or else you'll end up losing everything. You sound very sure of yourself. Looks like you've already convinced that chicken wing boy from the family. How did you do it, little peacock? Did you strip yourself naked, apologize to him on your knees, and promise that the IPC would never harm Panacone? Friends. Oh, please. You guys only treat others as your bargaining chips. Oh, what's wrong with chips? In any gamble, the only players that will never be on the losing side are the chips. My friends from the Garden of Recollection and the Astral Express are all smart enough to understand that. But the smarter ones wouldn't have joined the game in the first place. See? I'm smarter. Listen, little peacock. You've been invited by the tavern before, too. If you want the masked fools to get on board, you need to figure out what it is the laughter wants. Here's a hint for you. Since you can't convince anyone, why don't you find a rock to be friends with? At least a rock won't be able to refute your arguments. <laughs> So long. <laughs> Thanks. I'll keep your advice in mind. Ugh. <sighs> wow. 
What a pain in the neck. I guess I'll have to meet with the family again. Exactly is the second dimension. is the second dimension. I can't figure Dimension. Like... Dream border truly.
I'd better stay close to Firefly. Look! This place is breathtaking, isn't it? Guests aren't allowed here, so we have to be careful not to get caught. Don't worry, this place isn't dangerous, just, um, think of this as the border of Golden Hour. The family is still building and remodeling the dreamscape beyond here. My secret stronghold is in this area. Let's sneak inside. Excuse me, there's a construction site ahead. Unauthorized personnel are not allowed in. Trat! We're caught right away. Could you... Uh, please make an exception? We're not gonna cause any trouble. Uh, not a chance. Our boss made it clear that only the Dreamers are allowed here. He won't budge. Who? Eh, never heard of him. I wouldn't let you in even if the Dream Master were here. None of your tricks are going to work. Please do yourself and me a favor and go home. <sighs> Seems like you won't give in. Uh, let me think of another way. Perhaps Clocky's Clocky power trick can come in handy? Uh, this doesn't count as malicious intent, right? None of your tricks are going to work. Oh my goodness! Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! <laughs> Buddy, <laughs> you look, uh, you look as delighted as me. Ooh, 
Can you feel it? It's, this is wild. It feels like I just downed ten bottles of Apocal Soul Glad in one gulp and spent an entire day at the Dreamscape sales store. Oh, if Mia were here, we would sing a song together. Oh, I'm sure she would understand how I feel. I can hardly contain this palpable excitement. Oh, I'd like to invite you to dance with me, handsome. Right here, right now. Oh, no. It's totally fine if you want to turn me down. This crazy mood and this pound still. I won't let you- He really is a man of principle. Ah, oh, honored guests. I'm a member of the Bloodhound family, and my job is maintaining. Oh, so anyway, please just give me some privacy. You two should enjoy this fun and exciting dreamscape instead of talking to someone who is worse than a trash can. <laughs> Oh, 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 no way. <laughs> this, there's lit. I, sure enough, you guys can force your way through, but I swear. I feel really bad. How many times do I have to repeat myself? Unauthorized. Ugh! Do you two really want to stay? Ugh, you're asking for it. Oh, and I wouldn't be so cocky if I were you. I deal with punks like you all the time. You fear for nothing just because you're young and energetic. You idle away your time every day, going around, stirring up trouble. You contribute nothing to society. Let me help you spoiled brats learn the hard way. Go, Sweet Dreams Troop! Teach them a lesson! I've got a ri- 